guys welcome back this is the next part to uh, um, getting this hair washed uh, so I'm gonna take my glasses off and I'm just gonna show you what we are working with okay and as you can see the background is different we are in my bathroom with my pretty elephant so I'm gonna show you guys what we what I got going on underneath here if I can ever get it oh This is what we got. I was doing the greenhouse method to kind of keep my hair um, moist um, so it did not dry. Uh, so the next thing that we're going to do is the Curl Smith Scalp Recipe. This is their Super Slip Probiotic Primer. Again, it looks like this and this is step one. Um, and it says here, um, transform your scalp in three steps. The Curl Smith, Smith Scalp transformation system uses live microbiotic ingredients to actively improve hair and scalp health. Uh, Curl Smith Slip Probiotic Primer detangles and protects your hair before clarifying. And then the step two process, Curl Smith Wash and Scrub Detox Probiotic exfoliates, cleanses, and detox the scalp. The third step, Curl Smith Postbiotic Calming Conditioner cools the scalp and rebalances pH and moisture. So that's what it says here. Uh, so pretty much what you're supposed to do is wet your hair thoroughly and, and apply to scalp before you shampoo. Gently massage it. While the probiotics is working, make your, your hair your way all the way down to your hair length. Finger detangle until you get rid of all of the knots. Do not rinse out. Follow immediately with Curl Smith Wash and Scrub Detox Probiotics. The primer will protect your scalp while the shampoo clarifies it. So we have to use this and then we're gonna go in with um, the wash and scrub. I just had like a brain fart. Okay, you guys, so right here I am going in with the Curlsmith Primer. It smells really, really good. Uh, the consistency is almost like a shampoo consistency, but it does not lather anything, so you don't have to worry about that. The product does say to work it into your scalp um, and just let it like go through your strands. And while I'm doing that, I am going to be using the paddings of my fingers. I am not using my nails. We don't want to use our nails when we are scrubbing um, our scalp. Um, so you want to just use the padding of your nail. Just make sure that you're really working the product in, which you're going to see me do here. Okay, you guys, so right here, I am actually um, using the, uh, the shampoo now, the wash and scrub, the detox wash and scrub. That's what I'm using now. Um, this product also smells really good as well. Usually, by the way, when I shampoo my hair, I normally um, um, put it into two sections, sometimes four. If I'm lazy, it's two, but it looks like I was extra, extra, extra lazy <laughs> this time around because I did not put this in any section. Right here, you just see I'm feeling it because I noticed that it does have a slight, it almost feels like, I don't want to say sand, but it does have like that that consistency where you do feel that something is in the uh, scrub, which is actually really nice. It wasn't anything like really big, like you didn't feel like any bees or anything like that. Um, but the, the scrub did not lather. Uh, it does have like a little, which I, you'll see in the video, it does have, it does show or look rather like I do have shampoo in my hair but it's not stripping or anything, which I thought was really, really nice. As you can see, I, my hair is a little bit um, white. Um, I did have to, I used a lot of this product, honestly, because I did not know if it was working or not. I don't know if it's because I had the primer in my hair and then I went in and I used the shampoo. So I was, you know, I, I, I'm not too sure, but I will say that once I washed it out, my hair felt very, very clean. It did not feel stripped at all, but it felt really clean. So this is definitely a scrub that I can see myself using 110%.
I just finished washing my hair and this is how it is looking pretty good and my hair does feel pretty clean it doesn't feel stripped though so that's good but that's what I'm working with as you can see I washed it like really really made sure I got like cause that um, the scrub does have like these little fine beads um, I don't know I don't think they're beads like I don't know but they're it's very fine like you can feel kind of like sand almost in it um but yeah so i just wanted to make sure that i really washed whatever it was out of my hair so this is what i am dealing with so now i'm going to put my shower cap back on and then i am going to go and mix my guys like hair everywhere guys i want to actually also um keep tabs on how much hair sheds that i you know that i lose um so yeah that's why i also excuse me I don't have coronavirus okay but that's why that's why um, I always show you guys like the little bit of hair that I lose um, just so we can get an idea so this is like the first time we're kind of doing the whole entire um, routine and then we're just going to slowly um, just see if there's any difference with the shedding of my hair so yeah so I'm gonna go get dressed and then I am going to do my little concoction for my deep treatment and then I'm going to put that in my hair and I'll be right back.